evening, and thank you for joining us. I'm Mike Martinez. And I'm Jim Williams. You can run, but you cannot hide. Federal agents say they finally nabbed they would be bank robber in Oak Lawn. The police respond. response was enormous yesterday. Officers and federal agents swarmed the Bank of America at 111 Pulaski. It took them nearly 12 hours, but they finally got their suspect, who had been in a real jam. Derek Blakely is live in the newsroom to explain. Derek. Maya and Jim, it was a daring plan that went totally wrong with the bank robbery. FBI agents in surrounding the building, and in the air... This is 38-year-old in action, wearing a wig of long dreadlocks and wielding a gun, captured on a security camera as he was pulling the bank robbery at about 2 p.m. Saturday. When I made the decision to be with him, it was all, I wanted him to have all of me. So with that came an opportunity for me, I was able to be everything that he wanted me to be. I grew up not having much, so being amongst you know, seeing, you know, people in the neighborhood, men in the neighborhood that was able to get the cards, get the money, you know, get the jewelry. They always attracted a certain type of girl. And I felt like I could be, I can grow up to be that girl. So it was a life, it was for me, it was curiosity. So because I saw him as a, you know, he was a boss. He was, you know, I saw him wear diff so many different hats. So whether it was taking care of bills, whether it was providing for me, whether it was finding anything and everything that I wanted. And also I felt like he was a protector. So him showing me those different sides of him made me so comfortable and being confident that, hey, I can be whatever woman that he needed me to be. On June 5th, 2012, my life literally changed overnight. You know, he got up, kissed his son goodbye, and an unfortunate event happened that changed my life for the good. Now that I see, then it was the bad, now it was for the good. That when that happened, I said, hey, that was my, you know, sign from the Most High to say, hey, you have to chase me. You cannot continue to go down this road. He said, hey, search who you are, but you cannot have or, or find your self-identity without first seeking Christ. He can help you, he can reform you, and as I stated, you know, the reformation in my book, the reformation process is not complete for me, but I am absolutely enjoying the journey. I'm so excited to launch Officially Reformed on January 20th, and I want you to join me. My main inspiration behind writing Reform is that I understand that mass incarceration is plaguing our communities daily. Our men are locked up, yet our women are not even speaking about the effects of having a loved one in prison. From depression to being forced to be in a single parent, it is something that I felt was near and dear to my heart. And guess what? I too went through exactly what you went through. And I'm sharing my story in light of to show you who and what exactly helped me to reform my life. I didn't do it by myself. I had to seek and go on a journey of finding Christ to help me reform my life. I'm excited for this project. January 20th, we will be on the Amazon platform. There will be a celebration to help women speak up and speak out to assist our men to reform themselves as well. So, as I state in my book, the reformation process is not complete, but I am absolutely enjoying the process. Follow me on Facebook, keep up with Reform on Instagram, and I cannot wait to share my story on January 20th.